What up, y'all? Welcome. Welcome back to another one. We're out here getting down. Um, it's early. I don't know what time is it. Drusiv. Drusiv don't have a phone all of a sudden. Uh, I don't know. It's probably 5:30. Yeah. Yeah. No, it's Watch probably 45. Six. Yeah, it's probably six o'clock. Oh. Probably six o'clock. Loading up for a big one today. Big one today. Big feed. One of the best feeds that we've probably found all year. A good flight, a good amount of miles, and it's strictly snows and lessers only. So we're gonna get out of here. Preston's on the camera today. It should be a big, awesome hunt. Let's roll. Well, we're on the trailer, loaded up. Um, man, I'll tell you. This. So, so a little story about this. This, I'm in a whole new area where I've, I've really wanted to try before. Uh, never got the chance. Finally, with guiding, with old P Diddy, Jeffries. And old Drew, we're able to make it out this way. So yesterday I scouted uh, everything that I wanted to where I knew the birds were, and it was like, everything changed. We had no birds. So I just got on the highway and I bombed basically an hour, and bam, there they are. Uh, what I'm getting at is, guys, one thing about scouting, if you, if you find 20 birds, cool. Keep it moving. Don't stop, don't just sit there and watch something if you don't have to. Yesterday, the only reason I found these birds, holy cow. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> but what I'm getting at, guys, scouting, keep it moving. Cover as much area as you can. Don't just say, hey, I don't think I'm going to find them if I don't drive. If you have the gas and the gas money and the time, bomb around. You got to cover area. So today, this is a uh, cut corn field that was tilled in and then planted into wheat. That is uh, what all the birds have been preferring literally all season is a field just like this corn field that was again disc down and then planted into wheat those are the juiciest fields of the season right now well all set up uh pretty big spread i mean very large um we got um some new clients that have never been in a spread like this so it should be quite the experience for them uh low wind today so we had to make sure all of the socks we're uh, straight, I mean, leaning back, the, the, you know, the body's plumed up as much as possible. Uh, starting to dance just a hair though. I really hope it increases, dude. Mm -hmm. Like, it's supposed to be 10 to 12, hopefully we get 12 out of it. But, we're gonna go down the line. <laughs> you like that? <laughs> we're gonna go down the line, what's your name, where are you from? Chris Watson, South Carolina. Blythewood, South Carolina. Uh-huh, South Carolina. Yes, sir. <laughs> South Cackalacky, J.R. Collins, Columbia, South Carolina. Well, little South Cackalackens down here on the left <laughs> side. They're shooters. That's You've right. been hunting a bunch, though. Oh, yeah. Haven't you? Yeah. Big spreads like this. Yep. Up in Canada a lot? Up in Canada, yep. Randy McLean, Lugolf, South Carolina. Yep. South Cackalacky again. <laughs> and then, you three, you are a huge fan, and I am glad that you made it down here dude uh-huh name and where are you from my name is easton michael harris and i'm from jacksonville illinois illinois mama's obviously from illinois yep nicole harris from jacksonville illinois yeah how'd you guys what made what made you book it how did he give you the puppy dog guy what happened he's just a spoiled brat <laughs> <laughs> he's just a spoiled brat your mama said it not me <laughs> And then we got dad. If it wasn't for dad, you wouldn't be here. Nah, Michael Harris. I'm from Jacksonville, Illinois, and everything. I'm doing this for my family, and he loves you. Oh yeah, big fans, man. I'm glad you all are here, man. Thank thanks you, for sir. thanks for coming. It's gonna be a good yeah. three days. All right, two left. What's up, Bobby? I'm David Levery. I'm from Washington, and I'm having a great time so far. <laughs> it's big, isn't it? It's huge. <laughs> he came up earlier like Bob. This is huge. <laughs> oh yeah. Then last but not least. I'm Johnny Pockets from the woods. <laughs> what up, YouTube? Johnny yeah. Pockets Johnny, from the woods. Johnny Pockets, dude. <laughs> but here is the spread. Uh, it's the usual, huge. Um, I'm guessing we have out 150 dozen every bit. I'm always trying to decide if it's 120, 150. But here we go. This is the kill hole here. I say kill hole. This is where we should be finishing birds. Let's put it that way right here oh yeah way back we sit pretty far back in the spread if you can't tell this feed i found it yesterday this is exactly how they sit the white was up in the wind the dark was down in the wind match the hatch always try to match the hatch 
No matter how many decoys you have, just try to match the hatch. That one got smoked. That was my last right. shot. He got rolled hard, baby. Right, hey, on the left. Too. There we go. There we go. We got some white birds down. Yeah. That's what it's all about right there. Them Barassis were flipping, weren't they? That was beautiful. Shooting over there. Back. Well, there we go. They got two down on the left side. Worked them for a while. My tongue's a little numb already. Good stuff. If you're liking the video, if you're liking the big spreads and the video so far this season, man, smash the thumbs up. Let's get this baby up there. Come on. Pretty one didn't die. That was weird. That was weird. Had an odd chill run through the gun. I don't know what that was about. Got all, if, some, if something happens that's a little odd with a shell that fires, always completely unload your gun completely. Put the bolt back, right, and see if you can see light through the barrel. Make sure you're always unloaded, but you might have stuck a wad. It's always important to check. Shoot him. Well, there we go. Did not get the GoPro on for that one, so the shot cam got. I know I popped one. I know I popped one. First shot, there he is. Oh, yeah, there you are, buddy. There you are, buddy. You got any bands on you? What are you packing? You ain't packing nothing. Nothing good. There we go. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. All righty, boys and gals. We do have a gal today. Yeah. Got some white birds on the ground. Yeah. Got some lessers on the ground. Here you go, G. Yeah, buddy. Get sat back down. Well. This is getting rowdy. Go down, boy. There we go. They man, they they went behind us and came around low three dang times. Woo -hoo -hoo. Every time they did that, when they go up, you just gotta point your call at them. And go. go, 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 go. Try to get them to turn around. Oh, there we go. That was a good group of lessers right there. Really good group. They did it close. That was real nasty. Baby, nice, nice shooting. That was good. They balled up right here. Boom, baby. Look, that's how tight they balled up. They're all just laying together right there. Good job, Archie Daddy. Good boy. Yeah, yeah baby. That was good. That was some good stuff right there. Got one out there still. There we go. Looking good out here. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. Yeah. Where's my beef jerky at? Damn, so I wish I had a, I wish I would have had the GoPro on. We just decoyed some birds and they landed. I hope did Preston, did you get that on camera at all these ones I over here? On my phone. You did? Yeah. Man, they were like literally right here. One landed right there. 
and then seen me, looked me in the eyes and freaked out. There we go. Good shooting, y'all. Good shooting. <laughs> Got you, dude. You ain't getting away that easy, bruh. There we go. We're done. We are done. We're going to call the hunt um, because we're close and we have shot enough. That is for surely. Boy, how did they got in here? That was wild. That was wild, dog. That was wild. Dude. Boy, howdy. Yeah, buddy. Good hunt, dude. <laughs> We're going darn. That's fun. What'd you think of Sorry. the new? What'd you think of the new bibs that we got? I like them. A little long. A little long. Little big. Well, yeah, yeah just a little short. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I think they're nice. They yeah, they are nice. Like they me. keep yeah. off the mud and blood off Tins, of you, and you get in and out of them real easy. Oh yeah. Got them for all the clients to slip into. They are great. But that's a wrap. We are limited out and done. That there's a pile. That, yes, sir. That is a pile, brother. Yes, sir. That's a pile. So we double stacked the uh, Canada's. Here she is. That was a hunt. We finally got down some white. Three specks. One real nice one. But an eight man of lessers. Oh, yeah. All righty, boys. Let's load up, load in, and head on out. Got her loaded down, though. Oh, yeah. Lots of decoys today. That was a big one. Yeah, it was. Oh, God. Well, Drew tight. scouted, though. Did you Meow. find any good, anything good scouting? Yeah. They wanted to, kind of wanted to stay in town. They are pretty lazy. Did a lot of flying around. Um, found a couple pretty good feeds. Still waiting to hear back from landowners, but. Heck, yeah. We found some birds. There's plenty of them here. Yeah, it's a good time My of year, goodness. isn't it? Yeah. A lot of, lot of hopping water to water early this morning. Right. But, no, there's plenty of birds. No, huh, Oakley girl. Are you out here in the field with your braces on? Huh? Look at that tail. That's a happy girl right there. That's a happy girl. You pooped? Yeah, pretty good little hunt though. Yeah, dude, that was that was epic. That last spin we had. Yeah. They dumped. Mm -hmm. I mean, all lessers that last one. Uh, girl was like, "Yeah, we're done. That we're good. We're getting out." Give us a little two cent rundown old jeffrey's two cent rundown well today was pretty good yeah. decent we uh set up in another corn wheat field bob found that field yesterday got permission from the farmer set up today we uh started out pretty good had some lessers come in but at the end it got pretty rowdy you had one almost land on you yeah like I, feet oh from my. you i wish i would have had the camera and then the kid the kid had one land next to him and then the guys on the far left they had some oh, land they next did. to him they yeah too. yeah it was good i couldn't see down there but this one man he was coming at me so fast he freaked me out he did he just wasn't stopping he's was looking right at me then he got to them tall socks and it was kind of a wall he's like whoa it was awesome <laughs> literally thought i was gonna get plowed over by that little guy uh but amazing hunt um not to say that we knew anything, but we had an intuition that it was going to be pretty good. Uh, the area that we hunted today uh, just got a ton of birds, and it's uh, it's the area. We had, to, we had to drive a little bit, but that's okay. If we got to drive for a hunt like that, I will drive however far we need to, for sure. All these guys have never, ever experienced something like that, except for one. You all met him earlier, but man, boy howdy. What are you, uh, how what you up, feeling? dude? Johnny Pockets is doing good, Old man. Johnny Pockets over <laughs> here with the 10 gauge oh, spray. Man. You taking your, a bird home or what? Yeah, man. This nice spec, buddy. Yeah, dude. Beautiful, man. Beautiful. Didn't get too messed up by the old 10 gauge, though. No, no. Yeah. Yo, you taking one? Oh, you taking one home, Take too? Take that one, too. Nice. That's a good looking nice. bird. Right? Right? You don't get them over there. No. No. Doesn't so you, do it like that in Virginia, man. Yeah, Virginia. You, if you come from Virginia, you better take you a bird home, you know? Oh, yeah. Oh, you know, yeah. You never know. Because of the big C, who knows what next year might bring. Maybe we won't be able to do this. Yeah, we don't know, man. Yeah, no one knows. So, you got to take advantage of it while you That's can. Right. I'm glad you guys are here, though. Oh, thank you, man. Do you have fun, buddy? Uh-huh. Crazy? You take, yeah. Oh, you taking a cackler home? Yeah, I'm taking that home. That's a good little lesser cackler there. 
it's hard to tell you know see how small that beak is the body is pretty lesserish though yeah good looking one he's got a ring around the neck and all he's good. fat in the head yeah he's a chubby little guy isn't he uh-huh smaller than a mallard how you feeling Awesome, dude. I'm very, very awesome. <laughs> you had to kind of think yeah, about I'm what you're I'm say. blown away, man. I, was, told I, was, you. I was blown away. I'm, you know, not much of a bird hunter, all, anyways. But you're a deer hunter. Hey, yeah, I'm deer hunter, but this was totally awesome, man. I thank yeah. you guys very much, very, very much. Yes, awesome. I'm glad you guys are here. Yeah, it's a glad you guys you are having this. fun, yes. and I'm glad you guys are here. Yes, it's awesome. Thank you. We got to get the last minute reaction. Hey, wonderful morning. Like it. Did a great job. Uh, just a great venue, um, guys. Colin just worked her hind ends off. It was great. I'm Amazing. Glad. You guys worked your butts off. Thank you. You guys really helped we, we load and unload. It. That was big. We enjoyed it. It's wonderful. Great experience. Gotta gotta really give the clients that come a pat on the back when they bust their butts in the field as well. And it's so helpful, I'll tell you what. But I'm gonna give this camera to uh to old P. Diddy so he can get crack a lacking on the edit. But if you guys want to book a hunt, I, I'm gonna give a little update here. We're full for the rest of the season. I'm still getting a lot of emails, a lot of messages, and I'm sorry. There's nothing I can do about it. I can only take on so much. But next spring, we will reopen the books to the public after whoever wants to rebook, and uh, we'll go from there. But uh, subscribe if you haven't. If you guys want to pick up any white ducks gear or hats, you know what the deal is. Go down in the description below. When you guys pick something up, it goes directly to helping your boy, especially when the demonetization happens or anything like that. You know what I'm saying? All right, take this camera out of my hands and go do your magic.